Hello, preschool friends, it's Miss Shelley, and we are going to read a story called How Zebra Got Its Stripes. And we are going to hear some words like coats, disappointed, excited, matching, tails. Has anybody ever heard this story before? No? Let me show you the first part of the picture or book. How Zebra Got Its Stripes, a tale from Kenya. A long time ago, when the animals were new, they didn't have their coats or their tails yet. This bothered some of the animals, but not Zebra. She was happy just to eat delicious green grass all day long. Munch, munch, munch. Come and play with us, Zebra's animal friends called to her. Just a minute, Zebra would say. I'll be there after one more bite. Munch, munch, munch. Zebra would take one more bite, then one more bite, then one more bite. She always missed the chance to play with her friends. So why are the animals unhappy? What are they missing? And what does Zebra like to do? Yeah, they're missing their coats or their fur. And Zebra loves to eat. Oh, I don't know if they're ever gonna get her to stop eating. Let's find out though. One day the animals were very excited. Zebra, called Elephant, come quick. We're all going to choose our new coats and tails today. Just a minute, replied Zebra. I'll be there after one more bite. Munch, munch, munch. The other animals waited and waited, but when Zebra didn't come, they left without her. In a cave on, on a hill, the animals found all kinds of coats and tails, and they lined up to choose their favorites. An elephant was first. I choose the gray coat and the long skinny gray tail, said Elephant. He was so happy. Come on, Zebra, called Elephant down the hill. Just a minute, Zebra yelled back. I'll be there after one more bite. Munch, munch, munch. While Zebra kept eating grass, each of the other animals chose a coat and a tail. Tiger chose an orange striped coat and a long matching striped tail. Leopard chose a spotted coat and a long matching spotted tail. When the animals were done choosing, only one coat and one tail were left. Hmm. Why are the animals excited? Yes, because they get to choose their new coats and their new tails. They found, where did they find them? Yes, they found them in a cave. Nice listening, friends. Why doesn't Zebra join the other animals? What is Zebra doing that she absolutely loves to do? She is eating, isn't she? Oh, she's missing out. Let's see what happens. Let's see if Zebra gets her coat and tail. The happy animals ran back home, dressed up in their new coats and tails. Zebra saw how beautiful they looked, so she started running to the cave as fast as she could. And all the way, she thought about what coat and tail she might choose. But when Zebra got to the cave, she was so disappointed. The only coat and tail left had black and white stripes. The tail looked like a paintbrush. Zebra tried them on anyway. Oh, cried Zebra, these fit me perfectly. And off she ran to join her friends. When Zebra got home, the animals laughed. You got the coat and the tail that nobody wanted, said Tiger. But Zebra didn't pay any attention. She was thrilled with her new black and white striped coat and her matching paintbrush tail. 
I guess there's something for everyone, smiled Zebra as she chewed on a big mouthful of grass. Munch, munch, munch. So why does Zebra decide that she wanted a new coat and tail? Yes, because she saw her friends all with this beautiful coat and tail and tails, and she wanted one too. And what does Zebra find when she gets to the cave? Is she happy about what she found? Not at first, but then what did she do? Yep, she tried them on. And she said what? That they fit her? Yes, perfectly. Have a good day, friends.